Now we've finished with the two top pins. And we'll start on the center pin. Start with marking uh, the part that goes in to the wooden dummy. You can't mark all sides because you'll cut this away. So just mark this side and the opposite side. So we've cut that off. We'll mark it same again, both sides. We'll cut that off. Now we've finished with the part that goes into the dummy, and we'll start with this end. it off and it's nice and smooth and we need to start marking it on this side as well oh and you re need to remember this mark here is the total length so we need to transfer this one over here There we go, both sides. We mark up the center again. And on the center arm here, it's the same as the two top ones, 35 mil at the end, yeah.
Now I'm using a handsaw to mark this, but you can use anything that's straight. It just needs to be 100% straight. And this was just what I had. You have the thirty five mil at the top there again. We need to cut this off. Now we've cut it off on the bandsaw, and we need to start planing again. Now the reason why we make it a little bit longer than it needs to be is when we do put it up here, these ones will make a terrible mark in it. So we can cut that off when we finish planing. Now it's starting to look like something. Now we need to start making this round. We can make or use a normal hand planer, but that will take too long, I think. So I'll make, or I'll use one of those to make it round. Make sure you test it on a piece of timber so you get the exact um, radius before you do it on the actual pin. Now we've made them sort of round. The last thing to do now is just sand them off. The one is about to be finished. You can use sandpaper. I'll use one of these machines. It's a lot quicker. So, nearly finished. So, now we've finished. We've made two top arms and one for the center. So, those two are done. We're not going to do anything more to them now. Um, 
before we've made um, the log. There might be some small adjustments, so that's why we will leave them now. That's it for the arms.